ceremony will begin in two minutes. Please locate your parties and silence all electronic devices at this time. In the event of an IDL, immediately hit... Good evening, and welcome to the 1st Cavalry Division Mass Reenlistment Ceremony. My name is Sergeant Military, and out of that small number, less than 1%, raise your right hand and repeat after me. I, I, state your name. Curtis Lee Bodwell. Your name. Joel. Lalesh Kumar. Joanne Marie Hahn. Veronica Alyssa Medina. Kevin Coleman. Sierra Crabbe. Edwin Graziano. According to regulation, according to regulation, regulation and the Uniform Code of Military Justice. The uniform the Code of Military, military justice. justice. So help me God. So, so help me God. God. Major General Thompson and Command Sergeant Major Jackson will now present each soldier. Sergeant Jonathan Travanovich. occasion. These men and women are answering the highest call of citizenship. They have stood watch as the guardians of freedom. We are proud to call them members of America's first team. Military life is rewarding, yet even at its best, that life is difficult and full of sacrifice. You know, there's three things leaders like to do. They like to present awards, they like to promote troopers, and they like to re-enlist troopers. To you 17, I want to say thank you. Thank you for the privilege, more so, I want you to know it's an honor and a blessing to serve with you in your ranks. These are 17 troopers from the mighty 1st Cav Sustainment Brigade, Team Wagon Master, and from Team Maverick, the Headquarters Headquarters Battalion. They're signing up for a total of 80 years, eight zero years at a minimum. That's the minimum commitment they have just made. And they're getting some good bonuses. They're going to some good locations. In some cases, their better half says they want to stay in Central Texas and they get to stabilize. And for some of them, they're going to other MOSs. But ultimately, each one of them made the decision to continue serving. They didn't do that for money. They didn't do that for to get to be in some other location. They did that, just like all of us, to be a part of something larger than ourselves. To be a part of a team. To be a part of the greatest team on the face of this earth. And for that, we are extremely grateful. And more so, we are a stronger army today than we were a few minutes ago because of their commitment and their decisions. Rather than reading about history, everybody's making history, all of us. Today the RSSB hosted the mass reenlistment ceremony for the 1st Cavalry Division in Afghanistan. No, mass reenlistment ceremonies do come few and far between. Um, this is the second one that we have hosted in the last eight months out here, and they are amazing events. These show the monumental dedication and commitment that the soldiers have to the unit and the United States Army and their country, uh, and it greatly improves morale throughout the units. It shows how much they are dedicated to each other and their leadership. Today was just an amazing event. 
Um, our leadership greatly supported us and the soldiers. The soldiers would not have got here without the support of each other and their leaders. So the support of Colonel Colavita and Sergeant Major Crosby and of course Sergeant Major Jackson and Major General Thompson made this event a huge success. Perfect. It's like you've done this